Okay, so um, what you're holding the encore, it was it was called the Roundup a long time ago, but they figured um, changing it to a newspaper format would be better. Yes, I did. It was called the Roundup, and it was located outside of Corbett Center. Okay, it's actually upstairs um, by Pete's Place. Um, how do you? It's very sensational. You know, it's very colorful, and it catches my attention when I see pictures in color inside a magazine and rather than a newspaper. The sports page, of course, you know, it's uh, more, I'm going to say, catching in my eye and the food part. So you Yes, ma'am. It gives me a better idea of what's going on around the school campus, and it just catches my eye when I see it more than the dry paper. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Bobby Washington. Okay, thanks, Bobby. You're welcome. Um, recently, uh, the school decided to do away with the Roundup, which was our weekly newspaper. Uh -huh. They came out with a bunch of stuff. Oh, uh, like once or twice. Once or twice? Yeah. No, I did not. That's pretty cool. Thank you. Oh, this is really cool. I like it. It's very artistic. Maybe. Hold on. Let me keep looking. I think it's pretty good. I like it. Uh, well, I didn't know at first because like some of the some of these like sections are a little bit short, mm -hmm. but it grabs my attention. Um, maybe it might. Maybe not as news oriented as maybe a newspaper would be. Right. Okay. Yeah. But it does make me want to read it. Oh, okay. it's real professional. It's professional. Yeah. Like a legit magazine. Like a legitimate yeah. magazine. Well, that's all the questions I've got. Thanks, ladies. Thank um, you. Okay, Jennifer Whitmer. Jennifer Whitmer? Uh huh. And uh, what year are you? Uh, sophomore. A sophomore? Mm -hmm. Okay. And your sophomore? Megan Jimerson. Megan Jimerson? Yeah. Okay. Jimerson. A junior. A junior? Yeah. Okay, thank you all so much. Thank you.